Simon, tell me, why did you want to do an IPUP intern placement? Well, I was doing my PhD and unsure about which career path I was going to take afterwards. And during my first year, I think it was, I saw a circular email about the opportunity to do an internship in the media and thought that sounded like a great way to still use my history but not stay in academia. What was the first placement that you had with IPUP? Well, I went to a production company called Takeaway Media, which is now called Wingspan, um, and we were working on a BBC Two show called Balderdash and Piffle, which traced word histories and trying to predate them from their current Oxford English Dictionary entry and seeing if they were used earlier than the Oxford English Dictionary had them dated. So that was really interesting. It was using history, but it was also trying to find the interesting stories within the history. It was a great experience for me because it was a small production company. There weren't many people working on the show. There were a few, but not as many as you'd expect. Um, so I got to experience lots of different roles, researching the stories, trying to find the words used in the media before the Oxford English Dictionary entry, um, and also collaborating with contributors who'd sent in their own records of where they had the words used in diaries or things like that. So it really gave me a, a view of what television was and what, what, it, what it was about and what the job would entail if I decided to go into the industry. One thing I'd like you to share with other potential IPUP interns is really how was it for you to translate your academic history skills into the media? What was that experience like for you? They were surprisingly translatable. I mean, a lot of the analytical skills, the research skills are all key, and it does seem that TV today are trying to recruit more people who have more academic backgrounds because those skills are really important, and they bring another element to television which isn't always there now, especially with history being massive on television today. Tell me about why you wanted to come back to IPOP and do a second IPOP intern placement. What was it that IPOP was giving to you that you decided you wanted to really try and test out working in the media? It was giving me a unique experience and I also got the impression from the first one that the experience would be different every time but it would also allow me to build up the skills that I developed the first time around and there aren't many jobs that you will get the opportunity to experience during a university career like that, if any. What kind of shows did you work on for Newtopia? Well, Utopia was a startup company and it was based on them getting a big commission with the History Channel US um, on a show called America the Story of Us. Um, and they were making a taster tape for that, a four minute tape just to try and sell it to the channel. The channel were funding it. Um, and I was the researcher on that and I just worked very closely with the director. It was literally me, the director, and the new MD of the company, Laura. Um, I worked with the director, Ian Riddick, very closely through that whole process which sp spun out over two, three months in the end. Um, to create this quite high budget taster tape with some CGI in, some really sort of cutting edge television. So I was really, I felt really fortunate to be able to work in that environment. It wasn't just in a production company, this was kind of new age television as well. The show has now been filmed and aired and looks incredible as well. And it was History Channel's highest rated show ever. Um, was nominated for four Emmys and won one. Um, so from that taster tape that I worked on with Ian for a few months after doing the IPUP internship, this whole sort of mammoth huge show has, has been spawned and it's now out there and it's in 30,000 schools across the US and it's been a massive deal and from that sort of small beginnings it's, it's spun into something huge. What's been the result for you of doing the IPUP intern programme? Because I understand you've got a job in the media now as a result of Yeah, that. after working on the second internship I was offered a role um, at that company for the series that I've been working on the Taste of Tape for in Utopia and I'm there now. So yeah, the company that I ended up working for after doing the internship there with IPUP um, works on shows for the UK, the US, and it means that I'm getting experience of writing and researching and working on telly across different genres at different channels and different countries, and yeah, I couldn't have wanted for a better position, really. What would you say to another student who's thinking about answering to IPUP's call for having a experience with the IPUP intern programme? Media really is a unique industry, and there are not many opportunities to get into it. It's very competitive. Um, but it, and, it has, and the reason is because it has, an amazing, it has some amazing qualities and it's an amazing job. It's great fun, there's great people within it, um, it's really rewarding and there aren't many jobs that you will get the opportunity to experience during a university career like that, if any. So I would recommend that students definitely keep an eye out for the internship placements that are, are out there and, and give it a go. I mean it's two weeks or a month of your life and it could change your life effectively and yeah, without sounding too dramatic that probably has for me.